The first of two main events here in Brooklyn. A few moments ago, Stephanie McMahon said she wanted a revolution, and that revolution started here at NXT. The revolution being spearheaded by the likes of Sasha Banks and Bayley. Extraordinary women who give it their all and leave everything in that ring night after night. I have to echo the sentiments of Triple H from earlier today. We don't put our women in the main event. Our women are the main event. The title's on the line, NXT Women's Championship. The boss, Sasha Banks versus the ultimate underdog, Bailey. Man. Nice right hand. Sasha Banks has owned the NXT Women's title for 192 days, capturing in a fatal four-way back in February 11th at TakeOver Rival. And of course, Sasha's a big part of the women's revolution in WWE. She has a huge matchup tomorrow at SummerSlam, but the title is on the line tonight. Sasha truly believes she is the baddest woman around. Sasha told me earlier today she's not going anywhere. Team bad or not, women's revolution or not, it's all about the NXT Women's Championship. That title means so much to her. I wasn't expecting this killer instinct from Bailey. Nobody can match up with this woman when she's on a roll like this. Nobody. Remember, Bailey had to go through Charlotte and Becky Lynch to become the number one contender. Sasha Banks telling Bailey, you're just not good enough. That Becky Lynch and Charlotte were threats. You are not a threat. Hey, that's just more fuel for Bailey's fire. There's only so many times you can take being mislabeled and misjudged and not being taken seriously. Believe me, Bailey's had enough. I agree. I mean, come on. You defeat women of Charlotte and Becky's caliber and still don't receive the respect of the champion? It should dig at Bailey. I completely understand. certainly bringing the best that she's got, but it's just not enough yeah. to take down the boss. The boss is so confident in her whoa, element right whoa. now, and Bailey's whoa, taking whoa, the front of it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Bailey's starting to fire off. Bailey's showing some life. And now it's Banks face first off the turnbuckle. Where the hell is this even coming from? Ah! Bailey, an incredible resilience being shown here. Bailey's got Banks hung up in the tree of woe. This could be Bailey's moment. Yeah, boss. in this match. Banks is down. This has got to be it. Cover oh. for Bailey and a kick out. Oh, God, I had a heart attack there. Byron, looking at Sasha Banks and Bailey, do you think that Sasha is still underestimating Bailey? I think she is. Sasha could get in Bailey's face and talk all the trash she wants about being better. And Bailey is tired of hearing that, tired of being disrespected. Byron, there's a reason why Sasha's on Raw and SmackDown and Bailey's not. You want to know the biggest difference between Sasha Banks and Bayley? It's the NXT Women's Championship. The title's a reality for Sasha and a dream for Bayley. I gotta argue what you said about the differences between Sasha and Bailey. Dreams come true all the time in NXT. So why not Bailey? Why not a girl who's dreamed about this moment since she was 11? Sasha said it best when she said, I'm sorry, Bailey. This isn't a fairy tale, okay? This is real life where the boss is on top. She does whatever she wants to do. This is not a feel-good story. Oh, the reversal by Bailey. Vertical suplex, bam. And for the first time tonight, Bailey looking to attack from up high. Sasha doesn't believe that Bailey can get the job done tonight. Part of that reasoning is that Bailey has beaten Sasha twice for a number one contender spot, but lost both of her title matches against then champion Charlotte, at which point Sasha then targeted Bailey for wasting an opportunity. And that's the issue Bailey is trying to fight here, being so close to the finish line, but never being able to cross it. Horse forearm draped across the middle rope. Oh. 
To Byron's point before, Bailey winning can be very inspirational. But the truth is, sometimes you don't cross the finish line. You just end up living as runner-up. It's a very defeatist attitude, Grace. Sometimes coming in second only makes you want it more. It can give you the knowledge you need to get over that hump to reach your goal. You say defeatist, I say realist. Look, Bailey has the biggest opportunity of her life in front of her. She's going to have to fight until she can't fight anymore. I'll give her all the credit in the world. She is tough. She's just not tough enough to beat the bumps. Elbow drop. Piercing. Bailey looking impressive, dictating the pace of the match now. In the corner. This is not where she. Ah, uh, Bailey sends her opponent outside the ring. If the hugger has her in her sights. Boom! Oh, baseball slide right through the corner. You have to sense that fatigue is starting to become a factor at this point. Make no illusions of it. This is coming down to a battle of attrition. Look at Bailey here with the emphatic offense. Do you guys honestly believe the NXT Universe wants to see a headband wearing little girl as their champion? That's what we'll get if Bailey wins. Hey, there's nothing wrong with a good headband on a girl. I mean, it's functional in a fight, and I find Bailey's side ponytail to be quite adorable. As long as you keep the scrunchies off the wrist, then we're all good. Uh, Renee, I think Corey was talking more about Bailey being childish and not a good fit to represent the championship, not specifically her headband. Oh, well, then you're just wrong, Graves. Obviously, by the sound in Brooklyn tonight, the NXT Universe would love Bailey as the NXT Women's Champion, and I'm on board with them. Guys, have you noticed Bailey's wrist gear? Yeah, I actually saw it earlier today. Bailey wanted to make sure that we pointed it out for her. It's a tribute to Dusty Rhodes. Obviously, a man who's a big part of NXT, a huge inspiration to every competitor here in NXT. A fitting tribute to the dream. Yeah, but Dusty had an influence on the boss's career, too. Dusty helped Sasha realize she was the boss and that she didn't need anybody else. That polka. Ah, look at Bailey and Sasha. This has been one hell of a match. <laughs> Bailey went for the elbow. Sasha hung on. <laughs> Once again to the injured hand. Brilliant strategy by Banks. Just a clear bullseye for the champ to capitalize on. Well, this is the beginning of the end for the Huggable oh. One. Look at this ruthlessness from Banks. Yeah, but that's why Sasha Banks is known as the boss. Taking over here. My poor Bailey, this is such a bad situation for her right now. Sasha just focusing on that injured hand. Oh, a terrible situation. There is no feasible way for Bailey to win a fight with one hand against Sasha Banks. Well, just can't Bailey just yet break me? Yeah, she's in a bit of trouble right now. She's still got fight in her. Your eyes working okay, Renee. Now is the time to start discounting Bailey. She's done. for Bailey. Banks just taking her time. Ah. Sasha Banks now just torturing and attacking her. Oh, God. Yeah, I don't know how yeah. Bailey's going to come back from this one. I mean, her hand's done. Imagine what that's going to do to the rest of your body. Bailey in serious trouble. And now, what is, what is Banks doing? Unfortunately, the feel-good story will not have a happy end. Oh, my God, she made a broken hand. A relentless assault by Banks. Never seen the champ this aggressive, this ruthless. Bailey is in trouble. Bailey is hurt. The official's thinking about stopping this one with good reason. I don't know how Bailey can come back right now. I mean, you can't gain any momentum after that. Oh my God! Oh my I have to say, Corey, there is no sense of a lack of confidence on the part of the champ. She's supremely confident with great reason. The boss is someone you should aspire to be. While bailey has been a false role model, every single girl should look up to Sasha Banks. False role model? You're so off base, Graves. Girls around the arena are dressed up as Bailey. She's nothing but positive vibes. It's impossible to not root for this woman. Girls want to see this Bailey fairy tale happen. Well, fairy tales, unfortunately, don't have happy endings when you're facing the best, when you're facing the NXT Women's Champion. Ow. Straight punch.
much. Jarn. Bailey is showing her true colors. Red with anger. The momentum is clearly turned to her favor. You know, Ray, Bailey is out here with a lot to prove. Her family is in attendance and behind her, but we've seen Bailey fail in this situation before. Yeah, her mom's watched her lose these championship matches before. And listen, Bailey has said countless times she's just tired of letting people down, tired of letting herself down, tired of letting these opportunities slip through her fingers. Hey, tonight is different, though. Bailey feels it. The NXT universe feels it. And soon, Sasha Banks is going to feel it, too. The boss is going to make it hard on Bailey. Sasha's got the goal of breaking Bailey's heart again. Here it comes, looking for the Bailey to belly. Sasha Banks sinking Fight down her back. way. Banks rolls through shoulders down. Oh! Try to hang on. Uh, great counter by Banks. Oh! Face first. Uh, Sasha. Oh, this is it. This has got to be it. Can Bailey hang in there? Big statement. This is where the fairy tale ends. Is Bailey going to tap? Sasha Banks trying to snuff out the hopes and dreams of Bailey. Sasha luckily makes it to the ropes, forcing the break. The damage has been done. Now oh, what's Bailey got to do now? What's the next move? Bailey has her inner sights. Running clothesline. Byron, where do you think this unrelenting hatred Sasha Banks has? It's about to end. Piston like rights. What a match. What a match. A quick reversal by Bailey. Snap suplex. Bailey's got it hooked. Bailey, Bailey to Bailey. Shoulders down. Whoa, didn't expect to see that. She's going after her midsection again. And can you blame her? It practically has a target on it at this point. Oh, no. This does not look good. This well, is exactly what you do not want to see. Well, you know, the anatomy wasn't built for this. And Bailey connected nicely there. Elbow drop. Piercing. the face. Oh, she knows that one works. On the apron, what's Bailey looking for? And down. Ooh. Horse forearm draped across the middle row. Oh, look out. A surprising reversal from Sasha Banks.
bringing it back into the ring. Banks avoided that attack and hit back even harder. In a bad way here, guys. Oh, man, targeting the leg. Elbow drop. Piercing. Now momentum is in the corner of Bailey. She's fighting hard and reaping the rewards. Suplex. The WWE Universe wearing these superstars on. Pumping the adrenaline they so desperately need right now. Popped up. Down. Good grief. Right now, it's all about the NXT Women's Championship. Now, right now, Bailey has to silence that voice of self-doubt, that voice that calls into question your confidence. And Bailey has to truly believe that she is good enough to ascend to the next level. The boss is definitely trying to keep Bailey's fairy tale from having a happy ending. Great punch, nothing fancy. She watches she's in complete control. Oh my God, heading up top. Uh, I'm not sure I like what's about to happen here. Bailey has got something crazy in mind. I kind of love it. Oh! She wants to. The champ's eyes look glazed up. Will it be? One, two, Kick it out of that man. Used up her last bit of energy. He's going for the cover. of years of verbal abuse being told you are just not good enough. Bailey shook everything off, stuck to her guns, and is now the new NXT Women's Champion. The dream of an 11-year-old girl from San Jose, California, who has now established herself as the new boss of NXT, your new